the last four games, toughest time of the year. What What's the biggest challenge for coaches and what's the biggest challenge for players going down the stretch, particularly in a league like the Mid-American Conference? I think the grind of the season, all the practices, all the time, you know, all the summer uh, time you spent, and then getting up for every game, I think that's what's the difference between college basketball and college football is, you know, you play once a week in college football, you can get up every game, but in college basketball, when you play 31, you know, they know who's 5 and 11 in the league and they know who's uh, 12 and 2, right? And so you have to try to get them to play even keeled and play that uh, nameless and faceless opponent. So to me, I think the grind of the season and then trying to be emotionally even keeled and trying to play your best basketball against everybody. How, I mean, for coaches, I mean, that's obviously that's your job. So what do you do to kind of prod that? What do you do to, without going over the top, you know, and losing kids or losing the team? Well, it's a grind for us too. You have to be smart. You have to, you have to understand that this is, these are millennials now and um, you have to treat millennials different than you did uh, 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 the baby boomers like us, you know. <laughs> so you have to understand kids and you have to understand, uh, you have to understand to take care of yourself as well and not let every little thing bother you because if you really are competitive, you tend to really let things bother you. And if you do that, it rubs off on your team and you have to make sure that you're even keeled or at least fake it so they think you're even keeled. <laughs> Last one, uh, everybody's starting to peek down the road towards towards tournament play. How do you, do you like that? Do you try and contain that? I mean, where are you with the, uh, with your ball club with the, in that regard? Well, I think the bottom line is you have to get guys to relax. Um, I thought, you know, we didn't really relax shooting the ball against Kent State. We let the big game atmosphere probably affect us a little bit. And we just have to relax and play and, uh, and try to play our best basketball when it matters. I think that's one thing Buffalo did last year. They made threes in the tournament and they really hadn't made them most of the year. They relaxed and played and just let the game come to them. And I think that's what we have to do. Uh, we have to win the big, the little prize, which is the regular season, the big, the, the middle prize, which is the MAC tournament, and then try to win in the the biggest prize, which is in the NCAA tournament. So those are those are those are all really tough goals to achieve, but they're all within everybody's reach. And you just have to try to get guys to understand that hey, there's three parts of this season.